Hey boy. I'm, uh, my name is Jean. My surname Chin, so you can call me Jean, all right? I'm the business development uh, manager from My Laksa. And of course, uh, not just My Laksa. Today, our, uh, our main focus will be on My Laksa. So I'm also holding a post and I'm the um, IFD group. So My Laksa is one of the brand under My IFD group. All right, so today I'll be at 20 minutes. So I'll be counting from now. Uh, of course, I couldn't cover every single detail today. If let's say you want to have all details or more details, of course you can connect me uh, after today. All right, so without further ado, uh, of course I will let you all know uh, we have like more than 100 more over participants today. It's a very good number. So I will be sharing all of you about my Laksa brand profile and of course more details on the licensing kit. So probably um, I'm not sure whether all of you were put before the beginning as some we are the authentic one. And then uh, of course, if you have tried it before, and definitely will easily identify what is our taste different than other Asam Laksa. Okay. So from this picture, all is main laksa itself. The left side, you can see the very delicious and uh, uh, nice uh, soup, asa laksa soup with fish ball. And in the middle, you can see our brandings and the LED highlights. So the taste of unity here on the LED light here is actually one of our, one of our tagline, the taste of unity. So uh, of course, I will explain more why is it our, why is this our tagline? Okay. So going to our vision and mission, very straightforward. Um, we are moving forward directions of Ambassador globally as a Malaysian group. So as you all know that um, in the F&B market, you can easily find staple food, you can find other beverage. But as Laksa, this delicious food uh, can be a staple food because customers are tend to come back and come back every So we are also doing very well on our customer retentions. So upcoming for all the market approach, initiative, and campaign, you can easily understand that why we are doing so well on customer retentions. That's why you make them come back. And also, of course, we have a taste of Penang. Uh, as you all know, everyone agree that Penang is put up heaven, heaven full of delicious food. So uh, you, you don't have to purposely go to Penang and taste this delicious uh, Asam Laksa, but you can actually eat it on the Indonesia. Uh, in case you're quite curious, it's my laksa later on, so I will go through a little bit on where is our location for now. Okay, so how we started all of it? We started actually uh, two and a half years ago, approaching to third year. Uh, of course, at this moment, we are offering licensing uh, program and moving forward soon to next year, we are going to uh, launch the franchise very soon. So of course, at this moment, very good timing, please uh, grab the opportunity the licensing package first, but when we are approaching to find each surprising but different. Right. So in this very, very brief intro, KL, of course, is our second HQ already. Our first HQ is actually at midnight. Yeah, so uh, I would love to see you all in my office. Of course, in this period of time, pandemic, uh, we will virtually first and very soon, we can meet up in office very soon. And if there's a chance I will also belanja you all like a taste of uh, authentic as well. And a brief introduction of the logistic and warehouse site because uh, our location now is actually, um, we have more than 10 outlets, like a 13th outlet. So logistic and warehouse site, definitely we need to be very smart on playing our logistic. So we have more than one. One is actually more than, uh, at towards at the north, north side and the other one at uh, Sen. So for doing this, of course, it will it, it will a lot on your logistic fees. So my last plans, we have now total 12 outlet in nine states. Yeah, nine states, correct. So uh, why we are doing this is actually one of the strategy. We wanted to have like every Malaysian have a chance to taste an authentic Asam Laksa. That's why we are uh, spread our outlet in nine states and six is opening soon. Um, of course, we are actually approaching uh, 
another 15 outlet this year is because the pandemic, yes. That's why we are still waiting for the right opening time for it. But all of them are waiting up for opening already. And uh, total number of Lhasa Laksa, we oh, total already sold more than 2 million bowl of uh, Asam Laksa. It's actually uh, not a small number to achieve, but we really managed to achieve it. And of course, our brand is 100% Hala certified ingredient. All these places, yes, you can easily, uh, you can get uh, some laksa and taste, have a taste of laksa. Uh, so the places we are now at Belize, Kedah, Penang, Para, Kea and Salango, of course, Kelantan, Terengganu, Pahang, and Sabah is upcoming. All right, it's TBC confirmed on the location, uh, but yes, we are approaching to Sabah. So I, I don't know whether we have any uh, Sabah citizen here or not today. If not, then uh, you guys will have a chance to eat our food very soon. If not, uh, you can have a chance to open one for yourself as well. Okay, so this is a certificate. And of course, as you all know, if you are in the f and market, then you will know that it's two different halal. One is provided by uh, principal, it's ourself, uh, that on the ingredient. And the other one will be by uh, Jakim. So this will be your outlet. Uh, HALA certificate. This one, of course, you don't have to worry because we have all the uh, guidelines and steps to help you through. So to apply HALA certificates and this JAKIM certificate. Okay, for my Laksa brand positioning is very straightforward. We are the original recipe and also we're selling the price at affordable. Auto affordable doesn't mean it's uh, buying at the low price, but actually you are paying an affordable price. Um, then you get the premium quality uh, food. Okay, so our product, also why, how we make our customer keep coming back. Um, of course, the product itself, the spec, and also the secret. So the recipe secrets, we are never compromised the taste before. You know, um, as you all know, if you open up the franchise, uh, one common problem and crucial to maintain the taste maintain the product quality. How we are doing this area so well because we have like a series of SOP and it's also, uh, we are very, very strict on uh, our operation steps. Um, of course, if you're following the SOPs uh, and do any hanky panky thing, uh, for now we are handling it very well for all of the things on this for, for the taste and the quality. If you want to know more of the SOP, of course, I'm not going to tell you now. It's extremely secret uh, recipe uh, steps here. Uh, if you want to know more, you can let me know that I can share with you more like, in the next sections. Um, let's go through our products. Okay, so of course, the main um, um, menu uh, is our pinaksa. So each of our pinak asam laksa, we have different for it. Okay. Uh, Oh, a different name is not just uh, uh, the name itself, but actually to increase the customer curiosity. They will actually try each and every different items in our menu. So the first, a basic one, we call it Asam Kao Kao. And the second one, we call sure with additional uh, side dishes, eggs and fish ball. All right. Laksa Lawyer. So this one actually is our best seller because uh, they want to have like a full attendee. Uh, like a full package to enjoy Asam Laksa. So usually, um, customer will allow you. Asam Snacks. So this one is the uh, kids' favorite. You know, because our main target and also throughout the past um, two years, and we realized that all the customer, they are all a uh, community and also they like to bring along kids. So they are family-oriented customer. Uh, so this item is actually the favorite for all the kids. It, it is too spicy for them to eat the noodles and they will go for this asam snacks. It's also uh, one of our top seller. And we have the family sets um, to actually to con um, I mean to, to fulfill the family um, crave. Not just the menu for and in our menu also we end of last year we call it as a frosty series so for this one 
uh, we have like special seasonal uh, flavor. So why we are offering a frosty series like dessert shaved ice, because it's also like a demand from customer. They are prefer to eat like an ice shaped uh, cooling icing dessert together with the asta. It's like the best matching ever. So yeah, we heard our customer and we launched it. And upcoming every quarter, every three months to four months, we will actually launch a new flavor, like a seasonal flavor. So to launch all these seasonal products, it's not just to, um, one, one of the reasons, of course, to increase uh, our customer pool. And second, also to keep on um, driving our customer come, to come back. So these have two sizes, one uh, junior and one um, jumbo. Okay. Like the we have launched a mango series before during Chinese New Year season and upcoming we'll have either durian or the other flavor Let's give a teaser because a lot of people love durian very much so probably upcoming we will launch uh, for a dessert series of ice cream okay upcoming to uh, going into the, our store model we have like uh, my last if you would like to have like a smaller uh, outlets, like for example, you want to conquer at a place like more to wrap and go. For example, uh, uh, hospital, university, or even offices, office building. So of course, the first one, the smaller space, like for example, 150 square feet to 300 square feet is the ideal size for those grab and go concept. And if you want to have like a private sitting area for your own outlet, then can also suggest you to have like 600 to 800 square feet space to operate my Luxa. Uh, of course you want to have the bigger shop lot also yes um to have like a bigger space not just to have like more seating area but also to have like a uh, more flexible planning on the layout like for example to have exclusive storeroom for yourself uh, as you know if you have a store you will spend lesser on the logistic and you know stop ordering because you have your space to store it and also recently, also we just launched our uh, flagship sh shop lot at Sunga Basi Later on, we show you some picture. Uh, those are the commercial shop lot type, which is uh, more than 100,000 uh, thousand square feet. More than 1,000 square feet. Uh, it can up to 1,500,000 because we uh, recently were eyeing on the space at uh, Putra Jaya, Pristine 15, if you are well known with KL basis. Um, that area, we plan to have like a 2,000 square feet shop lot, right? The space is, and of course, it's very potential place to go in. Okay, so about the store model. Um, this is like a 200 square feet, 100, 200, 150, 200 uh, shop uh, is a purely grab. So we name it as My Luxa Express. Of course, uh, Express style, um, we only will be serving some uh, but menu, of course, because like all our menu are close to approaching to about uh, 15 to 20 items. So for this small little item, as for this small little outlet, we can approximately only um, main menu, which is the Asam Laksa only. Okay, like a bigger space, 600 to 800 square feet. You see, um, it's very easy to recognize our outlet and branding is because of the colors itself. Um, the renovations overall, the lighting. Of course, we will play along with all this thing. Um, the reason of this is this to do money because there is a right? we want to make our store as an Instagrammable for all the youngster. You know, um, the the targets that we are aiming also the young family. So if they are young family, means they are aiming for new and fresh branding to to approach. So this is also one of our tech tech customer. So if you shop lot types, definitely you can see there's more um, flexible on the kitchen layout planning and also seating area planning. And uh, you will also do more approach okay, on the marketing side. Some outlet design that you can see in more in details on what I mentioned on uh, all this uh, LED and branding. Okay, the shop lot design. And this is the one that I mentioned just now, which is uh, newly launched two months ago. It's at Sunga. So if you happen to be in okay, the area, you also can pay a visit there. Of course, now it's just Tapao season. 
Yeah, and uh, especially for those, uh, if you already win our lucky draw, yep, it's a, it's a great time to visit and to taste uh, uh, Fine Laksa. This concept here, this is a shop lot concept. So in a commercial shop lot. Um, for now, of course, uh, at this moment, we have our little shop a supermarket and also a commercial shop lot. So they have their own process. Okay, of course, if you have their perceptions and the growing shopping more of as a, a pros in, in there as well, is maybe um, when pandemic approaches, then we see a different a different uh, movement. Yeah, that's why this is one of the very successful thing uh, for this, this commercial shop lot. And, Moving forward, we might be open up more commercial shop lots because it is more flexible and um, the sales are coming in quite well compared. Okay, some of the marketing approach. All right, so this is the one that a few pictures for MCO, huh? And then uh, usually, opening we will make this like this big hoo ha. And uh, definitely, if you have concern that, hey, what? If you're doing opening, and no worries, we have a series of uh, crucial uh, actions that we know what to do, follow up the SOP. Great, new opening, event and promotions. So this is the example that we went to Singapore before. We support it in Singapore by right now because just last year pandemic, that's why it on for our plans. But our licensing there um, are patient enough to wait. So yeah, we are we are definitely going into Singapore, but for definitely not this year. So if let's say you have any friends and wanted to do business in Singapore, well, also a very good chance. Okay, some of the example for F event. So we this public city and event uh, is not just to uh, uh, you know sell our product, but of course to raise up our brand. So you can see that all this approach that we're doing are like so uh, diversity to everywhere to open, to just uh, main object, raise our brand awareness and share. That's why we also on and off to join in all this uh, non-profit organization and campaign. Okay, we the Astro Awani as well for the interview. And then previously we have the signing ceremony with class. Of course, if you are interested in going to a highway and approach any outlets during that, uh, uh, you can discuss with first, then we can come up with a different plan for you. Because we have previously signing with class. That's so why you're going in again, it's like so easy. Okay. And then also one thing, uh, we have our own uh, club platform as well. So this platform is actually to uh, for customers to collect points. The similar thing that when you're visiting to Starbucks and you wanted to collect points and so that your customer will keep coming back. So this is also one approach why we can do our customer well. So they can purchase and they can reward and they can buy uh, cash voucher for their friends. And then you can also uh, order your food now on this one. So if you want to join this as our member, so of course membership, uh, yeah, we have our memberships uh, package as well. You can get your points, extra points, and you will have your extra rewards for birthday months. So uh, you can search us on the Google. You just type my Laksa Makan Club and approach our website, and then uh, you can join our membership anytime. So uh, this is a very good platform. For this one, we use this yeah for customer retention. So every week or every month, they will actually come back. And one. So if let's say you are the licensee of MyLaksa, you will have the right and then uh, to uh, to get the, all the data analysis from this market. You know, we are doing this not just, um, not oh, customer retention is one thing, of course. Second thing is to have a better data analysis. So if let's during Chinese New Year, during Raya, and you want to have like a target pool, okay, to aim them for, for a certain campaigns and promotions, you can aim them very well. You can send that email, SMS, you can easily, yeah, it's very uh, good tools for us to aim our customers so we can do our marketing approach so well. Some collaboration examples. So previously also we have a collaboration with Nilo Fa. As you all know that she is like famous in the Malay community and uh, looking at the followers, she has 5 million followers. So while we are doing all this, 
collaboration, not just to uh, approach more customers and also to extend our uh, operations and our, our, our connection as well. So reaching at the win-win situations, approaching like her 8.5 million followers. Okay, yeah, the collaboration with the drinks and the product itself. And then previously we have like collaboration with Walk It as well, like a, a local uh, snacks. So total view online on the social media, we have a common a common community for two hundred and fifty fifty two k of viewers. So all this thing, right? Um, will actually bring us bring our brand to the second level, to the upper and upper level. To just not uh, we are not fully paying. But the, a lot of them actually come to approaches and take the pictures and posting themselves. Okay. And then also we have a series of models to help us do the branding. So we on the branding thing, a very awesome so marketing team to help us do all this, all the brand awareness and the marketing approach. So if let's say you're one of a licensee, you don't have to worry that, oh, how can I do my marketing? How can I do my campaigns? Everything are under this under one package. We will do everything for you all. You don't have to worry. And also, we have a push for uh, corporate sales. Yeah, so not just to end customer. We are also have a very great uh, collaboration with corporates. So we are uh, selling them cash voucher, and also uh, uh, we have a great you know collaboration. So uh, we are approaching like the great with the staff with more than you know. Uh, thousand, two thousand. So they are the big, big brands and big corporates that we are aiming to approach to into. So this one is already university uh, with Kawan Food. So uh, very briefly, I go through the licensing package um, because I have not much time left. So I will just briefly go through like the financial projections. So if you are interested, that if I put in like so much, so what will be our uh. So your total investment, initial investment, I would say is about to 300,000 included all, uh, all like branding, license branding or uh, equipment, uh, renovations, everything are in the, the total of about 250 to 300. So let's say on the RI projections um, of this idea number, low case are the references taken from our current outlet now. So you might have a question um, let's go after SEO. Uh, I would say this number is actually uh, we 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 recalculate you know during MCO since last year much. Yep. So we are doing this around uh, low cases. Yeah. Of course, it's depending on the location. Okay. So if let's say you are doing at idea cases, because most of our outlet are doing at idea cases, um, the sales were roughly about to seventy thousand a month, and then uh, minus off your cost of goods sold, uh, rental manpower. Loyalty, yeah, loyalty, money, royalty, we are getting about 4 to 6% currently. Uh, why is that two different rate? Because uh, we are giving promotion now, like the offer waiver. Let's say you are decided to go and package with us, we have the, a different uh, uh, loyalty rate for joints now. Okay. And uh, also, we minus off the utilities and miscellaneous. Let's say we spare about 2000 there. And management and marketing fee only, uh, charges. Tax would be 1000 so your ROI will be around roughly 14 to 16 months. I will be coming in uh, at most one and a half year. Yeah, I would say looking at this projections, um, the one you can get like uh, get your ROI back about two, two years and two and a half years. But the idea, idea if you select the very good location, which is like Sungai Basi outlet that we recently opened. Their sales are really doing very well, even with the MCO and FOSA period. They are still doing uh, more, more than the ideal cases. All right. Or I will be come back within a year. Yeah, within a year. So this is very visible because we are taking the number for our current outlet as well. All right. So here is all my sharing about my Lexa. Hey, boy.